What's going on guys, it's Jesus here again. Not to bring you another League of Legends video, today I'm going to be bringing you a video on how to uh, do a trace route on a Windows 10 PC. Um, it's it's something my main, the, probably the most popular video that I have on the channel is certainly the how to fix the high ping video. Uh, probably most of you guys that are subscribers are subscribers as a result of that with it just being under fifty or 35,000 views at this point. It's certainly taken off. Um, but what I've come to find out is people who you know have problems or it, it doesn't necessarily work for them. The first thing I, I try and ask them and trying to figure out is, do you know how to run a trace route? A lot of people don't know what that is, uh, and it's certainly a helpful tool in uh, you know figuring out what's wrong with your network. So I'm going to show you guys how to do that today. So um, first thing you're going to want to do is open your tool toolbar and uh, type in CMD. Go to the command prompt, hit enter. Boom, here you are. Command prompt, good to go. Um, so trace route tool that's available uh, by default in Windows 10. Uh, so in order to enact it, you just do trace RT space. And then uh, next, you're going to want to try and either do the URL or the IP address of whatever you're trying to trace the route to. Uh, in this case, I'm going to do to the North American League of Legends server just because that's where I'm based. I'll uh, put this link in the description below so that you know if you're in a different server, you can figure out what that IP address is by going to that link. Um, but I'm just going to copy that right there, paste it, and hit enter. And boom, automatically it's going to start this trace route. Um, so A, that's actually really slow on hop number one there. It's usually not to be expected. Usually you'll get like less than one millisecond most of the time. Uh, the second ping, uh, you'll notice has asterisks there. That's because the uh, my ISP, it, that's owned, that hop is owned by my ISP and typically the second hop will be owned by your, S, your ISP as well and they just block ping requests just because it's a good cybersecurity measure. Um, but then you, you go on uh, down below and you'll see, you know, 10, 9, 13, so on and so forth. And these are relatively reasonable numbers and it shows you basically the entire path that your internet connection takes to get to the server. And in this case, it's uh, the North American League of Legends server. Um, so yeah, it's pretty it's pretty simple. Basically, what you're going to be looking for is super high numbers, like when I had the you know 1,000 plus millisecond spikes in League of Legends. That would usually happen for me on hop one. Um, and so what that told me is this hop is certainly my router. Uh, in this case, it's the modem itself, and it's it was just getting overloaded, and so utilizing um, you know the QoS helped prioritize the information and help uh, make my ping better. Um, but yeah, so let me know what you guys think about this. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I've pointed you to this video. It's probably because the first video didn't help. And I hope that this you know helps you get some further insight into uh, how to fix your network problem. Um, just some other news, um, just so to keep everybody who is currently subscribed to my channel updated, uh, you're probably aware that I'm in the middle of selling and buying a new house. Um, in this process, we are basically under contract for both uh, houses. We close on the September 4th and September 6th, respectively. Um, so I'm hoping to put out some more content on in that second week in September. Um, but, you know, uh, I'm sure there's going to be some things that come up, you know, as we move into the new house. So it might be slow to start. But I'm going to be getting back to it as soon as possible. Thank you guys for sticking with me. And uh, thank you guys again for watching this video. I'm Jesus, and I'll see you guys next time.